After the 2024 Italian Grand Prix at Monza, Sergio Perez made headlines with some intriguing comments that have sparked intense speculation within the Formula One community. Perez, who qualified eighth and finished eighth in the race, shared his confusion over why his Red Bull teammate, Max Verstappen, suddenly seemed to be struggling with the same issues that had plagued the Mexican driver for the last several races. This marked a stark contrast to Verstappen's usually dominant performances, with the Dutchman qualifying seventh and finishing sixth, a far cry from his usual front-running form. Uh, I, I really feel like uh, I'm in the same boat as I've been in the last eight, ten races. Um, but now, all of a sudden, Max has come to, to, to similar issues. So, um, yeah, a little bit um, of a confusion there. Um, but yeah, it's clear in the data where, where the problem is. Perez's comments seemed to subtly imply that his prolonged struggles might not have been entirely his own fault, but rather due to something more systemic within the team. The implication was clear. If Verstappen, who has been untouchable in recent seasons, is now facing the same difficulties, then perhaps the problem lies with the car rather than the driver. And as a result, this has fueled ongoing rumors and theories that Red Bull might not be providing equal machinery to both of their drivers. The idea that Verstappen's teammates have consistently underperformed since Daniel Ricciardo's departure in 2018 has long been a talking point. Pierre Gasly, Alex Albon and now Sergio Perez have all struggled alongside Verstappen but found success or shown improvement either before or after their stint with Red Bull. This pattern has led to questions about whether Red Bull has been giving Verstappen a car tailored to his preferences, leaving his teammates to grapple with a machine that doesn't suit their driving styles as well. Adding fuel to the fire are the persistent rumours about Red Bull allegedly being caught using an asymmetric braking system earlier in the season, which has since been banned. Many believe that this device was only fitted to Verstappen's car, which could explain his extraordinary performance margins over his teammates, not just in 2024, but throughout 2023 as well. Interestingly, since Red Bull's supposed performance drop-off following this ban, Perez has appeared noticeably closer to Verstappen in terms of pace, as seen in races like Belgium, Hungary, Zandvoort and Monza. While it's undeniable that Verstappen is an exceptional driver, the sheer gap between him and Perez has often seemed puzzling, particularly given Perez's strong performances in previous seasons, such as his impressive 2020 campaign. If Verstappen had a unique advantage with his car, it could explain why the performance gap has been so vast. Perez's latest comments have added a new dimension to this narrative, suggesting that Red Bull may have been reluctant to replace him despite his poor form because they know the disparity between their drivers might not be genuine. If Perez's suspicions prove true and if Red Bull's alleged tricks come to light, it could lead to significant fallout within the team and the sport as a whole. Perez's remarks may indicate that he is beginning to piece together a picture of why his performances have dipped so drastically compared to Verstappen, hinting at potential underhanded tactics by his own team. If these suspicions are confirmed, it could be the catalyst for major upheaval at Red Bull Racing.